Warriors, you understand why these two guys can battle it out for the championship of the world. It all comes down to this. These are the two best teams in the world, and they have proven it time and time again, and they will do battle once more for the gold. Yeah, this is the match. This is the match. You know, they've been playing tournaments all year. Whatever. They don't mean anything at this point. This is the OS World Cup Grand Finals to be crowned first place. That's right. That's right. As we look on the screen, it's going to be the United States against the United Kingdom. United as one, but as far apart in terms of friendship at this point, these guys are more than enemies until this match is over. Yep. Yeah. Flashbacks to 1776 here. These guys are our <laughs> friends and competitors, but right now they are brutal enemies. Oh, you these guys. About that year, didn't you? You already went for that. 76. Yeah. Wow. I mean, hey, 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 hey. Maybe history could be rewritten here. You know, maybe. 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 It's possible. I think what I'm so excited for about this match is the fact that I don't know what's going to happen and either of these teams could win and that's what makes it so exciting. Yeah, we did have a little chat on the pre-show, which I'm hopefully some of you would have seen. We had a, yeah. a little official chat about the match beforehand. We're basically going to have a look at this bracket and see the journey that these two teams came on. But we said that we would really like, obviously with the UK coming from the losers bracket, they're going to have to win two matches here. Two best of 13s to topple down the Giants that are the US. Uh, yeah, we'd love no, to see that bracket reset. And we really hope it's a close match regardless of what happens. Yeah, and regardless of what happens, we will be here to get you through it. But as you see the journey that these teams have taken through the bracket, uh, it's it's been a long and brutal journey for these guys. But they're down to the end. And this is where legends and champions are made right here in the Grand Finals. And as we kind of talked about on that unofficial pre-show, um, I don't think that there's... Uh, if, you're, if you're a UK fan, not all hope is lost here because I do believe this map pool does tend to uh, favor the UK more so than the Finals Week 1 map pool did. As we take a look at it, here it is. As we discussed, this, this map pool is slightly more aim-based than uh, stream-based, which does help out the UK, considering that the United States are their opponents. So, I think there's a viable chance here for the United Kingdom, Bay. Oh, definitely. And like we saw yesterday, you know, we have these key rosters. We had Bubble Man have an insanely excellent day. FC's five out of 11 maps in the Grand Finals, which is just ridiculous. And pretty much all his other FCs were also insane plays. Like that five out of 11 stat, doesn't even include his unravel play, which was just ridiculous. Like SSing that map up to the 50% mark is just how? Just how do you do that? How do you have that level of consistency? And I really, I really hope, obviously, myself being from the United Kingdom, I really hope that Bubble Man turns up today. But they need to all turn up. This US roster does not oh, mess around. By the way, guys, yes. Both teams have agreed to allow Wub Woof Wolf to play in warm-ups. <laughs> So Wub Woof Woof is here in the Grand not gone? Finals. Poland not gone. Confirmed. Poland are not gone. Stop your crab raid memes right now. And you see he's, he's taken on the better team. He's decided to opt for the United Kingdom because he just knows that they're the better team to be on. I think he knows that they just need more help, Bay. Nope. Not I that. I think he's being fair. I think, it, I think he, he's just trying to make it an even match here, Bay. That's definitely what I said, not what you said. It's, uh, it's definitely the opposite. <laughs> but we'll, we'll agree to disagree. Are the US not going to have a fourth player? Oh, it keeps coming in. Okay. Oh, yeah. 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 But yeah, Are warm the US so... not going to have a fourth player, please? <laughs> <laughs> who, hey, who, who are you fooling? You know, sometimes they don't need it. And maybe that. Maybe if they went three before in warm ups and won, they can be like, well, UK, what you got? You know, tanks up to <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> what you got, mate? <laughs> who you got? Uh, yeah, oh, so warm up stolen last week. Again, this exact match, we saw uh, the UK go for a meme, Despotrito, Carthy remix. Well, the US opted for something more standard with Trick Lash. Do you think we're going to see similar style warm-ups today? Or do you think they're well, going to go all out as this is the last match? They have to, really, they do. But I love that Despotrito meme because after that, they went up by three. So it was kind of funny. Uh, well scripted right there. That's what I'm saying. Exactly, you see? Oh, oh, look at it. Oh, this is, this is beautiful. <laughs> Oh, for is, everybody who does not know, that is that is the beautiful man that is known as OPJ. 
This is a... Uh, this is a masterpiece. This is amazing. You gotta love warm-ups that have this much effort put into them. It's, it's like an art form, it truly is. Oh, the client is having a few issues, guys. We apologize. Hopefully we get it smoothed out ASAP. For now, we can just enjoy the music. Yeah, warm-ups will tend to do that sometimes. It's the first one of the day. You've got to give it a little bit of time. Yeah. It's warming up. Ooh. That's... that SV. Oh my goodness. It stopped! This <laughs> pick. This is beautiful. This is Wolf speaking. This pick is one oh, is it? Oh, it is! It is. To the teams who have oh my goodness. And who this, have is, this is... This is... This is Grand Finals, ladies and gentlemen. Of Would you expect Cup anything less? Press DK to pay respects to our fellow gamers from Scandinavia. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna let Wolf talk. Press DK. Pay <laughs> respect to our fellow gamers from Scandinavia. I think Dylan, we should let the chat enjoy this one. Take a moment. Yeah, of silence. I'm just, I'm just gonna be silent for the rest of this and let you guys take it in. R O for our Balkan friends. N L everyone. So, that ging. They deserve our respect. KR. Oh, 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 Love for an O. Yo! 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 Oh! No Spider Man's dropped. <sighs> Not the single one. A, U, it's Sunday. Sunday night, mm -hmm. and you're out with your mate. Yep. When you see a robbery unfolding right in front of you. So, what do you do? <laughs> you. Boy, Giants, this ah. This guy, this survey. Wait, call the cops! Everyone ready up and good luck. Godspeed. Godspeed, brothers. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Hey. HK. And holy hype. Holy GG. T. W.哇，完了！看一下吃才知道，又有感冒死的，咱们看。天啊，那我那我真的会立刻检举，操！BR。CA. My mom came in my room. She just like, we're eating now. Come eat. <laughs> he started doing like eating gestures. I'm just like, <laughs> JP. Omae wa mou shinde iru. Nani? Are you? Come on, come on, come on. We have to go to the police. Они обходят нас, Стелла! Перезаряжают! Прикройте меня! Противник на северном востоке! Противник на северном востоке! Не дай мне вторую! Они разжимают с юга востока! Заметим противник на юго западе! Так точно! What happened? And the third place belongs to... D.E. Nice, Jungs, Alter. Wir haben das, wir haben das, wir haben das. Oh, nice, Alter. So krass, man. Enough! Now that we paid respects to all the crabs out there, it's time to take care of the living. USA! That's right, I'm in the house! Oh my god. UK! Hold on, old chum! Now, go play some proper warm up. Good luck, gamers. On był zamocy, jej było źle. Gdzieś w internecie poznali się. That was beautiful.
Beautiful. Oh man, don't end the way of witness a masterpiece. That man. is the greatest warm up I have ever seen across all modes in my entire life. How long does this take to get loved? Or is it loved already? <laughs> it, it, this better be loved already. This is. Holy. Wubble Wolf, Wolf, thank you so Every, much for that. Thank you, Wubble Wolf, Wolf. The respect shown from the gamers. Wishing his fellow gamers the best of luck. And paying homage to all the fallen gamers in this World Cup. Everyone falls down in the lead, but they all fall out one by one. And that's our top two. What a gamer, Wub Wolf Wolf. Thank you very much, man. That was beautiful. And now I think we might play something a bit more, a bit more warmy uppy. Or as he said, go play some proper warm up. Go play some proper warm up, indeed. Got to get right. their hands back into it. That was rather slow for these insanely impressive players. Wow. It's hard to find words after that. But Just masking the glow that is that map. But I guess we are finally gonna have some warm up. Solid tribute. Gets me kind of emotional, man. Well, uh, maybe. Look at the difficulty name. America's History 8th Edition. Oh boy. Could be in for something. Uh, this, yeah, <laughs> this, this should be good. Yes, Poland is the real winner. You've won, well before you have won our hearts. Can we just give Poland the win anyway? Can we just upset everything? It was actually all in the script all along. Yeah, it was all in the script. We planned this. Obi James warming up with a hidden there. Yeah, OP James the hidden main for the UK team. He pretty much plays every map with hidden when given a chance. Yeah. That, that'll make you good at hidden. Yeah, I'm surprised we don't see Sorox just picking up hard rock though. I, I like OP James is the hidden, Sorox is, is the hard rock. But I guess the star rate for this map is probably absurdly high because there'll be some ridiculous spike later on that he decided not to. Yeah, this one is quite lengthy as well. These guys are going to get good and warmed up. This is the last warm-up, potentially, of the 2018 Off World Cup. I don't think they have warm-ups for bracket reset. I'm not sure. They have warm-ups for bracket reset. I didn't know. That's why I don't I think they do. If someone can confirm for us, that'd be, that'd be really useful. Yeah, are there warm-ups in bracket reset? So I'll I, leave it with a potentially. A potential. Oh, oh, Big no. old question mark. This is... This is, in fact, the last warm-up. Hey, this one's really going to help your fingers get warm. Just constant streaming. Yeah, that'll definitely get him nice and warm. And the uh, the score at the bottom, Madonna, is affecting how this match is going to go. 100%. Whoever wins the warm-up wins the match. It's not warm-up, all right? Whoever wins the warm-up wins the match, though. L listen, listen. Yes? You need to calm down. <laughs> I'm calm. You sound a bit, a bit angry there, because I've, I've just spoken the truth, and you're not, you're not accepting me, though. Well, listen, listen. The truth is yet to reveal itself. In before the UK, like, four man fail now, and I just look like an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody fails. You are right, the US seems to be struggling with doing the four map, but... So are Roxas, though. What are you doing? Um, Bubble that's a, Man. That's a 600 combo. Oh, never mind. No combo for Yeah, Sora. yeah. Well, Bubble Man, though. Come in through. Uh. Uh. Get he the cast curses out of the way. <laughs> oh, there goes Bubble Man. Okay, never mind. I mean, everyone broke. That was a really hard section. To be fair, this map is rather, rather hard. Yeah, if anyone's cold after this, then I don't know, man. Didn't try hard enough. Yeah. This will get their mind back into the, the match. The match mood. Yeah, but warm ups are out of the way for grand finals. That means we'll be getting into rolls and bands for both of these teams. So 
for those that do not know, this is a double elimination tournament, which means that the United Kingdom coming from the loser's bracket need to win twice against the United States to win the World Cup. The United States coming from the winner's bracket only need one. As we take a look at that map pool. Oh, and the UK win the roll by five. A nice roll from the UK, 88 to 83. They'll take the win on the roll. And hopefully for you, Bay, that's a, a good sign of how this match may turn out for all the UK fans out there. Win the warm-up, win the roll, win the game. Hopefully it is as simple as that. So UK going to get the first pick. All right. So we had a little chat before the match about potential bans here from the two teams. It's going to be the US to ban first. We spoke about bans potentially unravel after Bomberman's performance yesterday. We also spoke about Habitus Ferry as a ban that the Germans did yesterday. Or Higher Saitama, a final potential ban for the US. These are bans that we thought they could go for, but it looks like they want their timer applied. <laughs> The US are like, you're going to do this properly. We're going to go by the book all the way to the end. By the book. And when it comes to the UK then, bans potentially, as the US are very good at awkward maps that require, you know, very technical mechanical aim, or maps that are very high at circle size. Um, it's an army's whale, the hard rock map, was a potential in my book. My day is the consistency at raw aim map, jump map against the UK, or Intersect Thunderbolt against the US, uh, UK, as they are 8-1 and one in three mod picks right now, which is pretty scary. Yeah, that's, but that's they're going to do nothing like record. They don't go with anything I said, so I look like an idiot. They're going to go with Re End of a Dream, which is a map the UK actually lost yesterday, I believe, against. Yeah, banning out one that they lost. Uh, actually, no, they did win. Uh, sorry, and Bob Man got a reverse choke. Yeah, they did win, but Man reverse chokes it on with him, which is pretty insane. Yeah, it's, uh, that was a pretty insane play. The UK played very well against Germany yesterday. Specifically, Bubble Man. Hopefully for the UK, he's able to carry his team through here, carry that momentum, and hopefully his teammates are able to step up. Having a few issues with the next stream, well, our stream, sorry, right now. So we're just going to be a couple of seconds, guys. We can't currently see what's going on, but we're doing our best. Yeah, just a few tech issues. We're trying to work it out right now beforehand, so uh, we don't experience. The UK, once again, going to ban away the Senya double time map. 10.3 approach rate. It's really high AR, something that the US are very good at. And the UK can't put quite together a four man roster to combat it. They banned it again against Germany as well. So a enough ban, which is consistent for them. And I expect if we go to a bracket reset, we might see the same thing again. Yeah, potentially. But the bans are in, and that means it's time for the first pick. It is match time. I am super hyped for this. I'm so ready. And the first pick is going to be Intersect Thunderbolt, the free mod map. Oh, wow. We saw the UK, the UK lose on yesterday to an insane Dust Ice no mod pool combo. Yeah. I mean, that kind of stuff you don't expect on a map like this in a tournament setting. Dust Ice just pulling it out exactly when his team needed it. But still, overall, I believe the UK did perform better than Germany. It was just that one solo carry from Dust Ice. Yeah, the UK didn't play bad on this at all. Uh, it was just Dust Dice just had an insane day, had a field day on this map and uh, was able to give Germany the point yesterday. So UK should still be fairly confident on this one. And he explains their first pick here. So they obviously feel confident on it. We'll see how the Americans respond. Oh my goodness. 
Grand Finals about to get underway. It's all come down to this, Bay. We are here. What a hype song to kick this off. Players choosing their mods now. So yesterday we saw one hidden hard rock from each team and one hidden. That was Carthy playing hidden rock and Bubble Man playing hidden. Will we see the same thing again? Bubble Man didn't do quite well as enough from hidden as he probably would have liked to. Same thing with Carthy, they had a lot of misses between them. Yeah. I mean, this map is insanely difficult with mods. It's just a highly intensive map. From Here start to we really go. Four hard rocks, two apiece. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? For the grand finals, let's get ready to rumble! And we are going to see a change up in mod stolen. Double hard rock from both teams. Yeah, no different than on the board. They ran yet yesterday against Germany. Yeah, this is the perfect fight song to start this match off with. All right. Well, early miss from Sororoxis gives a slight advantage to the United States. The client's going to play catch up here. We started too quick. Yeah, too fast, too furious. So yeah, far, no. that's the only difference maker here. Oh, and there comes some early misses. Oh, three misses oh. across the board. Sororoxis, Carthy, and Fiery Rage dropping. That's two on the UK. One for the US. All hard rock drops as well. All the three of the mod players down backside, the only one remaining. Yeah. It's really going to help the United States here. But again, it's not over yet. Only a third of the way through this opening round. And this is the UK's pick. But Vaxi and Toy find misses. And now the advantage is with the United Kingdom. That's cool. It's only back quickly. Thorox is dropping again. But it's Spare and Bubble Man. Together with Carthy. Holding for the UK. I score slowly coming back into the UK's favor. Accuracy is across the board in the way of the US at the moment. But it's the combo yeah. game, the bubble man and spare oh, coming out. Oh, toys dropped again. Spare drops, it's a big drop. That was a few separate misses there. Spare dropping out of the stream. Vaxi, Carthy's down. This team versus bubble man. Madness. Fiery has a good combo for the US as well. And with Hard Rock, that lead is going back to Nicky's them. Nicky's down. It's down to bubble man. Fiery Rage is trying to match him, but he just can't. Is he doing it already? First map of the day, Bubble Man performing for his team. Oh, he's great! Oh, he's dropped it! You've cursed him! Big drop from Bubble Man! Drops across the board! Impossible to keep up! The US have the lead! It's so close! Down to the end! Roxas drops! Vaxi! Fiery Rage! Toy? What is happening? Toy? Toy? And the point has gone to the United States! By 11,000! Oh my god. We don't get to see what exactly was. Stolen! Toy left as soon as the map ended. The US it didn't went... get the point. But, oh, I wish we could see on the screen how close it was. It was oh, 11,013 11, points. 11,013, the difference. The United States take the opening point. We will have to fix that scoreboard because Toy left so fast. I'll tell, you what happens. I'll tell you what happens, Olin. That little bit of buffer we had at the start, essentially it doesn't obviously buffer for the players. So as the client reached the end of the song, they'd finished, the scores had been looked at, and then Toy left. But because of that, it looked like Toy left very early. Really yeah, unfortunate. Yeah. Nothing we can really do about that. But such a close start to this match. 11,000 points on the first map. It's on the over. first map. That's a big break point for the US, so they're going to follow it up here with um, Moso Kajitsu on the Hard Rock. Yeah, this is a super aim intensive hard rock pick. So, so Roxas pulled out the victory for the UK here, getting himself 880k points yesterday in a really impressive first map of the match, I believe. Yeah, yeah it was. Okay, this is something we talked about in the pre show. The UK need to get the ball rolling early here. It was a break point for the US. They need to break the US back here. You cannot get down early if you're the UK because they have to win two games in a row. Hopefully they can turn it around here. But as you said, yes, the UK did perform pretty well on this one yesterday. So it's kind of an interesting pick here from the United States. Yeah, it's only saw Roxas though that performed excellently. Everyone else performed okay. Around 500k mark, which is about expected for a map like this. 
And the cover the difficulty spikes in terms of clustering these jumps, and the ending gets pretty ridiculous. And I think the other only other part of this map which the players will find really difficult is some zigzag streams, which are kind of they're not five note directional, so it's kind of hard to explain. But they're like four notes left, four notes right, which is quite hard to aim. This player is obviously excellent though, and would expect most of them to do it, but you can expect breaks at that part. Yeah. And here we go on Hard Rock. So for the US, it's going to be Munko, Iggy, Fiery, Vaxi. For the UK, Bubbleman, Carthy, Sororoxis, and Spare. Same lineup they used yesterday, I believe. Yep. And they did have a pretty decent performance on this map yesterday. So we'll see how the Americans challenge that. This is the Americans pick here. And the UK winning the early act battle. Oh, but Spare has dropped! Map is a reasonable length. The early break shouldn't matter too much. Yeah, but Fiery's gonna trade it right back, so no worries for the UK. They are back in this one. As you said, this is a game-based map. Has a few little space streams here and there. Oh, it's all oh Zora! That's a big miss. He performed so well on this yesterday. Vaxi, Bubble Man, and Carthy! Spare! Quad miss for the UK! Misses everywhere! Three Americans down, it's Icky carrying for the USA! Yeah, according to Matt, the first Orca jumps, here come those quad streams, exact. And Monko finds a big break on there, so easy to yeah. completely miss your aim. Yeah, the USA, the other three players still have to build combo, because the UK, if they build enough combo, they will be able to stop Icky. If the other three Americans consistently miss. And the issue missing on those cut screens is that you drop a ton of accuracy, that mark accuracy for Monko down 97. And that's why yeah. the score is relatively close right now. Yeah, the UK having great act. Sora Rocks is dropping though into the 97's Fire Rage as well. They're gonna trade misses here. But going to the break, and the UK will see that they're ahead in terms of combos. They keep their barely, here, yeah. they can bring it back. Yeah, the UK just barely ahead of the combo bench, and that's gonna grow. Spare with a miss, so not gonna help that cause. That's a really painful miss. Up on the inconsistent. Sora! Carthy! And that is big! All that combo advantage is now gone, and Icky is negating Bubble Man, and then some. Monko is there as well with a nice combo of his own. But he drops, I've cursed him! Vaxi's down! Icky has the mess, or it's all over. It's Icky versus Bubble Man. Into the last quarter now. Sora struggling even more. This is Icky's mod. If he's going to pull this play out, it's going to be on a map like this. Yep. Icky Hard trying to in. put some distance. Monko, big miss on the stream there. They're up to a decay at this point. There's only a slither of map left. Unless there's a fail, which is unlikely on a map like this, the US will be bringing their second point home. Yeah. The US trying to take an early commanding lead. Sora struggling even further. Vaxi is dropped. But no fails. And that means the US take a 2 0 lead over the UK. Yeah, lovely FC from Ipke. Coming out, showing the hard work is his playstyle. Yeah, amazing stuff from Ipke. After the 4 100 C miss. Oh, my man, with one miss as well. As well. Relatively yeah. decent play from the UK, just unfortunately, Sora and Spare struggling. A little bit Bobman and Carthy playing pretty well there. But Icky's a madman. I'm saying struggling, Donan, but look at the average scores on both teams. Only Itki has over 500k for the US. This was a real solo carry from him. Yeah, it really was. He alone negates two of the UK scores. With Sora and Spare getting under 500k each. They will be patting him on the back there saying, Thank you, mate. Good carry. Yeah. Thanks for that point, Icky. <laughs> but the UK now have a chance to fire back, and they really need to fire back. Down 2-0. You don't want this to get out of hand if you're the UK. Yeah, we saw them yesterday take a lot of the more awkward maps like Unravel, Unravel and oh. this one here. Oh, speaking of awkward. Yeah, highest sight from the 2000s, sorry. This map yesterday we saw Bubble Man 1-100 with Spare with the one miss right at the end. A really unfortunate choke from him. Yesterday in chat, Spare dropped the SS or no KFC. And he got no KFC yesterday. I think he'd like it today, Dolan. Yeah. Yeah, if the UK can repeat their performance yesterday on this map today, uh, they should be in really good position because the UK played pretty well, all things considered, with the 1-100 from Bubbleman and the, the choke at the end for Spare. 
Yeah, I mean, it's super awkward. Lots of single taps with bursts spread throughout. The 2009 map, potentially the oldest map we've had in the World Cup this time around. Yeah, I agree with you there. It's, it's definitely one of the oldest. It's a bit of a banger as well, not gonna lie. It's just the kind oh, of... Yeah. It just... It just drills into your head and you love every second of it. <laughs> it is a pretty catchy tune, I'll give you that one, man. It does kind of stick in there. So, lineups look like they are finalized. The star command has been issued from the ref. We're going to see Carthy come in for the UK today instead of Sora Roxas, who was the lowest scorer on their team last time. Yep. So we have Apraxia, Herak, Toy, Vaxi for the United States, Bubbleman, Carthy, Doomsday, Spare for the United Kingdom. Definitely expect Toy to do a really good performance on a map like this. This is his map style. Yeah, Bubbleman's got a matching performance yesterday to keep up with Toy. See if he can do it again as we get in. Misses should be coming in across the board. Herak will find the first for the Americans. Praxi as well. Super awkward. Uh, lots of linears. Here come the bursts. Spread throughout. Carthy first miss for the United Kingdom. Praxia drops again though. UK still holding that lead. Doomsday is performing a lot better today than he did yesterday on this map. First half is where you expect these players to be really consistent. Four double S's across the board so far. Insane play from these guys. They will drop 100 as I say that. And Toy as well drops his double yeah. S into the halfway oh. mark. UK with Bubble the lead. Man. Still going crazy. Vaxi and Carthy find misses. Apraxia as well. Doomsday and Spare will miss together. The US trying yep, to pull it back. Vaxi yeah, dropping again. Doomsday and Carthy again. Bowman still Toy. playing well. Oh, but that lead is just with the USA. It's a wide margin. Carthy and Vaxi again together. Herak. Bubbleman is down. Carthy, Abraxia. And that's going to do it. The USA lead 3 0. But Toy. With the FC. Wow, Hirak really tanked 11 misses right at the end. But Toy does what he does best. He gets himself a full combo for 100s. It's good stuff. Yeah. And overall, the US just coming out looking super consistent. Yeah, the US looking super consistent. They want to end this in game one. The United States do not want to take this to a game two. They want to end it right here and become the world champions as fast as possible. Yeah, the switch out from Sora to Carthy obviously not paying off. 300,000 is the lowest score the UK have had on this map in two runs. Really unfortunate. And they are finding themselves three points down in this grand finals. Yeah. But it's not over. Not over till it's over. The US still needs four more points. And the UK are still in this match. And they have maps in this pool they can pick from. Yeah, we still see Tabby, Tabby to Ferry open, which is a map that the UK would potentially have liked to pick against Germany yesterday in a match against Toy and Dirac, though. After those performances, I'm not sure you'll be too confident. Unravel as well, the map that Bubble Man can see for a part is in the UK ensemble as well. But again, Toy just matches Bubble Man in terms of these awkward maps. It's where do you go to the UK? The US, though? Still see. Potentially, I wouldn't have said bad Alexa right now, but a good map for them. We said last week they had the stream favor. This is the stream no more consistency map of the pool. Yeah, it does does make sense for them to pick. But I just said, yeah, they're gonna go for it early, and I think I think honestly that's a smart move for the United States in their position. They're trying to snowball this hard. So they're gonna go ahead and pick this now to try to get that point to make it four nothing. They're trying to back the UK into essentially a mental corner here. It's really hard to come back from a large deficit, so they're trying to open this up as much as they can. We'll see if the UK can stop this. They need to for their World Cup title stake. Uh, the UK were down, uh, oh sorry, 3-0 in that finals match, and the US managed to bring it around. Maybe we're just going to see a complete error. Yeah. This is the point the UK needs to win. This is a big one. Yeah, this right here is a is a vital point for the United Kingdom. 
I think the U.S. know that, and that's why they've picked Bad Elixir. Well, here we go. Round four. No mod from the United States. Apraxia, Fire Rage, Inki, and Vaxi. For the UK, Bubble Man, Carthy, Doomsday, and Spare. No substitutions on that side. Baron Bubble Man had pretty decent performances on this yesterday. Dust Knights was the only full combo in the lobby, though. Yep, Doomsday early drop with Fire Rage, though, to offset. And the UK have the act lead. These strings are super intensive. Lots of spacing. 203 BPM. Yeah, this is nothing to laugh at here. This is some serious business. Nothing else. That score gap is so close. Yeah, Fire Rage is there two early breaks. Big action drops from the tomb as well. Yep. US taking that lead now off of accuracy. It was so close. The rats getting to the nitty gritty of the map. Yeah. The longest screen's coming in now. Keep your eyes peeled, everyone. We could see anything at any moment here. Spare's gonna drop from the UK. Big advantage for the Americans. The UK need a quick miss from the United States to offset it. Will they see it? Everyone hits that first phase stream. Everyone on the US hits it. And everyone in general in the lobby just spare trying to recover after the miss. Oh, he's not gonna be able to. He finds another one. They're uh, lacking the consistency he showed yesterday and it's really costing the UK right now. Yeah, unfortunately, and the American just holding so strong. Fire Rage recovering quite nicely after the miss. Oh, I say that, and then he drops. Doomsday, though, as well, is going to trade it immediately. Vaxi's dropped. That was a big drop. Tank a lot of back, too. Doomsday fails. Comes back. Apraxi is down. That's another full combo for the US down. Bubble Man and Carthy still going strong. Is it coming home? It's coming back. That's the it's coming home. Matter. The UK stealing it at the end. Bubble Man with the miss. Final stream. No fails. And you can put them on the board. We said it, Dolan. They had to win this one. 3-1. Stop that momentum. They've done they it. They needed the UK. that. Yeah, they needed that so bad. They were able to steal it right at the end. And the UK snatching one at the end from the Americans might keep them alive. Yeah, they lost this map against Germany, but Carthy, that is a performance, my dude. Two yeah. 100s. You want to talk about a rebound from the previous map to this one? That's amazing. It's really hard to do as a player if you have, you know, not so great of a performance to come back and FC the next map. That's incredible stuff. Inky with the FC as well, too. But the other three players for the UK outperforming the other three players for the US, giving them that point. Well, maybe we have a game on our hands. At least there's no clean sweep this time around. No clean sweep. You are right about that. Take back to the UK. If they can get this one, they are going to start gaining some momentum themselves. Yeah, maybe this is here. Yeah, as we said, it's, it, this was a crucial point. They stopped the, the momentum from the Americans. Now they have a chance to kind of turn the tables here and start snowballing themselves. Maps we didn't see get played yesterday include Camino Kotoba. This is the map that Bubble Man hit in Hard Rocks earlier this week. Also didn't see the other free mod Camellias towards the horizon. Really awkward it. Technical map. Yeah. Several maps we haven't seen. We may see them today. Unravel though, coming from the UK. Uh, we expected this one. Let's yeah. see if Bubble Man can repeat his performance yesterday. Yeah, Bubble Man had a field day and a half on this map yesterday against Germany. If he can repeat here, he'll be putting his team in a good position to take a second point. Walter getting some quick rolls in there. Yep, 49 is pretty average. Pretty average indeed. We see some substitutions coming in as James like for the UK, his first appearance of the match. So hopefully he's warmed up and ready to go. Uh, this is the exact same lineup we saw yesterday for the United Kingdom. 
James Like is the UK's technical no mod player. But this map sits just outside of tech and just more awkward. Lots of rhythm. Lots of really yeah. hard aim as well. Lots of snappy one two patterns. And it just gains in intensity from start to finish. And honestly, you'll see misses all through this map. Yeah, we see Vaxi and Fire Age coming out though. T-Rack and Digital Hypno coming in for their first appearances of the match in the Grand Finals. Yeah, Digital Hypno is the kind of map that this guy loves. He plays really insanely hard stuff. People have known well for being the player. He's only a thousand ranks. But this guy plays like a two-digit on the day, and it's really scary to learn one to look out for on a map like this. Yeah, it looks like we are getting set for round number five. The United Kingdom on their no mod pick unravel, trail by two. Looking to cut the lead in half here. Always have to look out for toy on maps like this. Of course. His precise aim is just perfect for this kind of map. Indeed, we'll see how it unfolds here. And right now, the US with a slight act advantage. Doomsday finding some early act drops of spare. But the Americans also finding act drops of Praxia. And he wrecked. First uh, so awkward jumps. Doomsday is going to find the early misses. And that was a big drop. This map is very long, remember, and there's going to be lots yeah. of misses to come. Yeah. Doomsday won't go too bad about that one. Yeah, it was very early too. So it's not impossible. As a matter of fact, they've already got the lead back based off of accuracy. No double S for Bubble Man this time around. Just one 100. How pathetic. A toy, the only one with the SS right now. Here we go, getting into the breakdown now, into the chorus. Uh, definitely going to be spiking here. Who's we'll see to do another set of nasty jumps. James like, Apraxia going to trade it though. Both those misses were kind of even in terms of how severe they were. Hirak, Digital Hypno, Toy, triple miss from the Americans. The UK, holding with two FCs and Doomsday's combos right there. And once Big again, that lead. bubble man accuracy, 99.83. This guy is so consistent on this map. The floodgates are open for the UK here. They've got a huge lead, and they're going to continue to snowball it if they can hold on. The US are going to need to see an absolute meltdown from the United Kingdom to take this one. This slow section is such a free combo for the UK to pull ahead. Digital hit, though, and Hirak struggling even further. Oh, this is 50 level from the UK. It's so satisfying to watch. We have Apraxia. Spacing. They're all holding strong. Yeah, not a single one of them is behind. The Americans struggling. Bubble Man and James like find a miss, but that's not going to be enough. That is not going to be enough. Oh, Doomsday Spare now is the only one with the high combo. And it's still a full combo. It and is the, all on spare right now to hold this big point. circle screen coming up where Bubble Man missed yesterday and Spare can get through it. Yeah, if Spare can get through that, the UK will be home free. Toy! He does it! Proxia. It, it doesn't matter! I hit it! Spare hits it! Oh, he afterward. He rack is there! It's but is it going to be k I don't think there's enough. This map is going to go, but... It's going to be cool. He's dropped! It doesn't matter! It doesn't matter! The UK are going to be taking their second point if they could just hold on and avoid failing. I don't. Regardless of this outcome, spare comboing past that space circle pattern is just ridiculous. Oh, he acts. He absolutely came through on his team and found the consistency. Really gave set his team up quite nicely here. And there's just not enough time. There's nothing the U.S. can do here. This is going to the U.K. Unless we see some crazy fail shenanigans, which I don't think we will. Yeah, not on this map. Has a nice real tame ending. Yeah. Oh, man. The consistency of the U.K. roster on this map is phenomenal. This is world-class stuff. Yeah, we knew the U.K. were going to perform strongly here. It was a little bit of a battle there for a sec, but... Americans not able to find the consistency on Unravel. And it's 3-2. The lead is cut in half. Our exact mirror of their finals matchup.
Went three to two as well. The next map went in the favor of the UK, but they were ahead of the time. So would it be exactly the same? Is the script already written, Doland? I don't know. Oh, did you get who, it? Who knows? Do you not get it? Oh, I meant to forward it to you. Hold on. One second. Oh, oh, just, oh okay. Just, and, uh, okay, there we go. I, was, you, you I don't think I was included in that email. Yeah, sorry, man. I, I must have forgot you. Yes. I'm sorry. Oh, man. Worst time to ever. Worst timing ever. But anyway, the U.S. have the next pick and a chance to reestablish the two-point lead. Now they need to stop the U.K. snowballing. There's a lot of good picks here for the U.S. They still have is an army's whale, the 6.5 hard rock map. Small, higher circle size, meaning smaller circles, definitely a U.S. advantage. Could be used to hold the U.K. momentum. Yeah, definitely. There's a lot of there's several maps that the U.S. could really turn to, and they're going to towards the horizon, actually, the Freebon. Yeah, map we didn't see yesterday. This map is just insanely hard. I mean, if anyone remembers all the way back to the showcase, that was a whole week ago. Though. That was so long ago now. Yost Pie full combo this map with Hidden. And that performance alone is just insane. Like, world class. I, I spoke to Yost a bit afterwards, and he said that when he submitted it, the map holders were like, huh? You full combo this with Hidden? Are you mad? The shout you have to fight for that. Yep, so we're going to see it play today, though. It was not played yesterday, as you mentioned. But again, yeah, I, I understand why the Americans would pick this. I mean, a really difficult map. And on paper, they, on paper they're the best team, so... Trying to go for a really difficult map, maybe to just try to break the UK here, really. And in terms of the mods we're going to see on this, I expect we will probably see more hard rocks than hidden. The technical nature of this map with the AR, I believe it's AR, ooh, let me just double check this until I get it wrong. AR 9.5, the object density is really high and some of these passes are really awkward to aim with hidden. Yeah, these definitely can be. As we see some substitutions coming in for both sides. Backseat is back in with Fire Rage, Toy, Digital Hypno. The UK still looking for their fourth. Depending on who plays Hidden here, I expect Bubble Man might pick up the Hidden if they play Hidden in this map. Maybe Opie James to come in to fill. Oh, he gets and, it, oh, right. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Nice. I'd like, nice I'd like to think I know my guy as well. I'd like to think I do. He's on fire. Hey, coming in clutch. So with Opie James stepping in, expect him to pick up Hidden. And then maybe Spare to take Hard Rock? Or Bubble Man? Oh, it's so hard to decide between those two for me. Side of the US though, Backstay Hidden? Question mark? Fiery Rage Hard Rock? I mean, honestly, the thing is, the US, uh, they could do that. They could spread the two mods in so, so many different ways, so many different players, honestly. It's, it's kind of hard to predict that. It's whether the teams want to try and take a risk with Hidden. If they have someone who's really good at Hidden, this map is definitely Hidden favored, but oh, I don't know, man, it's so tough. And Vaxi, Bubbleman, and OP James with Hidden, Fiery Rage with Hard Rock. Oh, so close, man. Bubbleman taking the Hidden. UK. Risking it for the biscuit. Yeah, so the US have a slight mod advantage in terms of score. Hard Rock gives more score multiplier than Hidden. But obviously, Hard Rock comes with the risk of reducing that circle size, making it much easier to miss. And also, the accuracy window gets smaller, making your accuracy harder to obtain. We have Fire Rage tanking our early ac here. And the UK Could just be early like... adjustment. This map very yeah. hard. It, yeah, it is. It, this is a this is quite a difficult map here. We'll see how these players handle it. the whole bottom row going with no mod. Vaxi early miss for the United States. Early advantage to the UK. And one more combo down. It's only the hit mode. Much more painful if they lose the hard rock. Yeah, would have been. Yeah, you're right. Would have been a lot more painful. UK still UK, quite though. strong. Actually, so Hypno goes down. Yeah, Digital Hypno dropping as well. That's two FCs down for the Americans. Map UK looking to tie it up. Yeah, halfway in into a slow session. Some free combo for the UK to go their lead. Already over 200,000 points here. 
Yeah, but this is this is a crucial part here. Halfway through, the UK cannot miss here because that's just the worst place in the, to miss in a map. How does Opie James have an A? What happened? Did he miss? <laughs> he missed the first note. Opie James. Oh no. And that's gonna offset basically. That's a hidden and a nomad down. Vaxi's missed again though. Fiery Rage is down. The Hard Rock is down. Doomsday missing. Bubble Man again. OP James is down. It's spare. Oh, Digital Hypno's down. Toy's down. Everyone's, Everyone's down. Dead. Spare had the highest combo in the UK. Do still have the lead, but I think it's slowly yeah. coming back to the US here. Yeah, I don't. I don't think there's enough time. I think the UK got this. Quad miss for the USA! That's gonna seal the deal! Everyone but Spare and Bubble Man for the UK, and these two are putting their team to victory here. Absolutely insane madness is struck here! People missing! But the UK's early game consistency gives them the point, and we are tied at three! It is a mirror! The UK running three points back on the US this time! Who needs best of sevens? We, uh, best of thirteens when we have a best of seven. We should just go to tiebreaker right now. Yeah, let's do it. Just skip the maps. Let's play the tiebreaker. Yeah, get it over. Yeah. yeah. Four play, man. It's tiring yeah. me out. Let's get to the main event. Yeah, we, we got a second game potentially after this. Let's just go to tiebreak, settle it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't want to be on too late. You know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm an old guy. I'm yeah, it's like, it's like almost 1 p.m. for me, dude. That, that, that's. Oh. Like that. How are you standing? Oh, well, sitting. I'm actually you. sitting. Oh. It's getting quite warm, though, because in this suit. <laughs> hey man, they can't see it, but we know we're wearing suits. We know we're looking classy. It, it, that's right, that's right. <laughs> but uh, the United Kingdom, back to the matter at hand. They've done it, they have run it back, tied this game. They have the pick now. Tabby the ferry is open. I mean, that also, I the UK would look, like to go for. Also, me and you is on their radar. Played I insane, though, that last map. Yeah, that massive combo hits like two of the insane up and downs with like jumpy patterns, which is just ridiculous. Yeah. Just USA, whatever. that so for USA that was a blind pick. They do not know going into that map how the UK would perform on it. So I think they took yeah. a risk to see how the UK would do, and obviously it backfired. Well, at this point, the time to take risks is uh is over. If you're the US, they are tied. And again, the worst case scenario, like the US, they need to win this in the first game. Allowing the UK to win a game will give them confidence. And then you'll have to play the same map pool again that they just beat you on. So it, it can easily turn. Uh, the tides can easily turn against you if you're the winner's bracket winner by dropping that first game. But again, I'm sure that they're playing the best. Oh, definitely. They're definitely these not giving teams, up. Yeah, these two teams are the best in the world. I'm They've proven them. that this year. Where I think a long thing. Go? I think a long thing. Base drop freaks. Tabby to ferry. No thank you. Three maps that come to mind. Yeah, we could see any one of those. For me, is a bit of a bit of a coin toss, being that it's hard rock. And they're gonna do nothing that I said in classic UK style. We're gonna go for my days. My days, though. Yeah, no man. This is just all about raw mechanical aim. Lots of jump patterns in this map. Very long as well. And again, what we said, this map pool with the aim picks does help the UK out a little bit. So they're going to try to stick to the aim based maps. They they won that hard rock aim pick earlier. The Gumi, whatever it's called, the, uh, the Japanese name. Moso Kajitsu, I think. Yeah. Oh, the hard rock map. Yeah, the hard rock map. Yeah. yeah. The UK took a point on that earlier. So looking to play the aim game here. Uh, the US won that. Oh, they did? Oh, my bad. They did. Because of the uh, oh, insane no, performance. Right. I got it mixed up. Good caster, by the way. A round of applause for Donut, everybody. He does, yeah. his, he does his best. Coming from catch to standard, this man does what he can. Listen, 4v4 is too much for my fragile little <laughs> brain. <laughs> but anyway, Vaxi. <laughs> Vaxi, Monko, Toy, and Icky's back in. Yeah, this is uh, all about consistency and to the highest degree. These jumps get screen wide. Map does not give up. Yeah, absolutely. This map is pretty brutal on the aim. And the UK right now have all the momentum in the world. They have 
they're on a they've scored three points in a row. So uh, the U.S. have to answer that, have to stop the momentum. So they're going to challenge the U.S. on every level until they can stop them. The U.K. will take as much room as the U.S. give them. And we'll see if the U.S. give here. Makes you wonder why the U.K. took so long to pick this. Yeah, maybe they had, they had, again, you even came up with a few maps that they might have potentially picked there. So It just makes you wonder what... if, they're, if they're stalling to save those maps for later and going for something that they're just maybe feeling a bit good on now. They did pick this yesterday against Germany, and they did end up winning it. Yep. Bubble Man. We'll see if he can do it again. So far, no misses to report. Act lead with the UK just slightly. It's dead even. Oh, correction, they actually did lose this against Germany because Dust Dice also for combo. Oops. Whoopsie daisies. Right, nice caster. I try to get my stats right, but um, I, I do my best, okay? It's okay. You did your best. Just like these players are doing with 8-Way FC right now. Oh, nice transition. You, you like that? That was a good one. Just whipped it in there. No misses to report. It's an act battle right now. An act battle that the UK is winning. Ever so slightly. Now the US are pulling ahead. It's oh, just going to be US back and forth until the back. first miss. And there it is. Zora. It's Zoroxis with the first miss. Still, a, there's plenty of time left in this map. Monko and Carthy will trade, missing at the same time. Those are going to offset. You see the frustration from Zoroxis with the smoke on his screen. Yeah, and that no, break, they see that one. one. And the US know that they're up 3-2 to two in terms of four combos. Spacing only going to increase with every break, and the jump sections will kick in soon. Yeah, almost halfway through now. Misses here are deadly. Deadly on the combo. Another little break here. Only halfway in, anything can happen. One full yeah, combo it... to determine the match. Yeah, still anyone's game. The Americans with a slight advantage at the moment. But it is anyone's game, as we've said. Comes the intensity, building up slowly. Jump space yeah. getting bigger and bigger. Everybody hitting those cross-screen jumps. Nobody getting caught out just yet. And with all these big combos, a miss is going to be absolutely punished. And there it is from Toy! Well, the UK hit that. That is so important for them oh, right now. Oh, the UK hit it and Toy! Got caught out! Not the player you would think to drop! The full combos are level. The US are still not they're not too bad right now. They just need to make sure that vaccinated if you hold. Yeah, and the UK slowly pulling it towards them. Icky's accuracy. 99.9. Insane stuff. Also, it's important for the UK to hold. They cannot miss here. They're slowly but surely pulling it back. This the miss will eliminate their chances. Monko's dropped! Here come the British! Monko the British are coming! Ball. No, they're not! Bubble Man and Sora rocks his fall! Spare as well! Fair. Carthy's the only one! Vaxi with the full combo! And Ipki, don't count about 99.92. Yeah. SS is that entire section. 99.5 for Vaxi as well. Vaxi, Ikki holding Monko, Spare, and Carthy dropping. Ikki's down! Vaxi's down! No full combos to be had! There's no combos for the UK though. They should be safe here. Only about an eighth of the map left now. Oh man, just crazy shenanigans back and forth, but the US banks some solid points. And unless we see a meltdown from the United States, I don't think it's going to overturn here. Spare finding a miss as well. What do you think of Grand Finals map stone? Do you think of 8-man 99% plus accuracy? Uh, no. No, I don't think about I don't think about that at all, but it what looks are we like looking at? we might get. 8 people, all 8 players, 99% or better at. My god. I mean, I know the map's not particularly trying on your accuracy, being as it mostly jumps, but even so, it's just so impressive. Uh, the level that's... of consistency that all of these players display. But the US will come out on top. Everybody with 99% act, and the U.S. finally answering the United Kingdom's challenges 
with a break point. They take a 4-3 lead with the pick coming up. And now it's right back on the UK to break the Americans' pick. I did think that was a bit of a risky pick from the UK, taking a consistency map against the US. While their raw mechanical aim is pretty on par, as we can see from that map only being about 86k difference, it was such a coin flip when there's other maps which I think are more favored towards the UK. Perhaps they're just thinking to save it for later. Yeah. Maybe this Maybe was so. the map that they, they've worked it out, right? They've worked it out that if they win the maps that they want to pick, this is the map that would be the, the coin flip and they want to get it over now rather than later. Yeah, take the chance on the coin flip, see if you get it. That could be one way of going about it. But for the Americans, they have some choices here. Two hard rocks, two double times, two hidden. Yes. It's an army as well. It's definitely one that I think the US were favored on. Serendipity. The UK won that against Germany. Bubble Man with a full combo. Of course, Bubble Man with a full combo. Uh, Kamino Kotobo again is a coin flip for me. Moonlight Wave is a coin flip. Like, so many of these maps are just coin flips. UK Honestly. Fairy, no thank you, I would say, is favored to them, but anything can happen. It's so hard to 100% with confidence say, this map is for this country. And Serendipity, they're challenging Bubble Man. They just don't care. That Bubble Man have seen it yesterday. They said, you did that yesterday. Can you do it right now? Again. They did, they did actually lose this pick against Germany yesterday while Bubble Man had the really impressive full combo. Okinamo actually had the top score of the lobby. And the average score for the UK players was then around 650k minus Bubble Man. Yeah, so Moy maybe Yandere. the US getting more consistent. Moy Yandere making his debut in the Grand Finals, the DT player. Yeah, definitely a map that he is a big fan of. One missed it yesterday, along with Spare with a one miss as well, so the consistency could be there for the UK. U US yeah. does have a lot of really good hard uh, double time players with Vaxay and Apraxia. Yeah, they definitely do. And in the UK, they, they were so close to putting up together just a terrific performance on this map yesterday. And they've got the core there, they've got the pieces. They just have to put it together. I think we're going to see a very similar uh, overall play out compared to the last map in terms of it's just going to come down to who breaks uh, more consistently. Who can hold their cool at this point and keep the combo? Yeah, yeah, that's... Honestly, I think I think that's we could say that about every map from this point on, really. Just looking at most of the maps in the pool left and like, with these two teams. This is an absolute battle. And uh, you love to see matches like this. But here we go. It's going to be the, uh, the first DT map of the match, I believe. I believe one was banned. It's fine. And here we go. So for the US, it's going to be Vaxi, Apraxia, Hirak, and Monko 2K. For the UK, it will be Bubble Man, Karthi, Spare, and Moe Yandere. Yeah, UK pull out their DT specialist for this one. In Moe. Yep. He's waited patiently for his time. And here we go. There's map about 10.1 after double time applied. Not quite up there in terms of 10.3. A couple of early mysteries though from Monko and Carthy. But Monko's miss was bigger and the ack advantage is with the UK as well. So they're going to have a noticeable lead here. But the misses were traded so it's still anyone's game. No misses to report yet. Hirak, Bubble Man, and Carthy spares down as well! And that's multiple misses for the UK. Three of their FCs are down. Only two on the American side are down. And Monko's combo is pretty good. He's caught up quite nicely. The Americans have the lead right now. And a big one of that looking at the combo advantage. Vaxi and Apraxia still on four combos. Monko with the 350 combos to come back with. Yeah. Doesn't look good here. Does not look good for the UK. And the break they know. Still not even halfway through though, so much map left to be played here. Americans in command right now. Bubble Man with a miss. Oh, 
No, they had to hold on here for the UK. If they want to try and come back into this, and they need breaks from the US at this point. Yeah, they do. Any break will be beneficial. A lot of pressure on Moe right now. But right now, no one's finding any misses. Just past the halfway point. Carthy, though. On the burst. That's not good for the UK. That score difference is growing wider and wider. 300,000 almost. Spare has dropped. Ooh. Monko finally dropped. It's but, all too late. Yeah, it's not one of the full combos either. Vaxi, Apraxia, and Moa Yandere putting in great performances. Well, when two of those names are American, what can you do? Not much you really can do. Hirak is a decent combo to boot as well. Yeah, Hirak has really recovered quite nicely with the 830 combo. Moko, the only one who's been caught out, but his teammates are doing so well, they're backing him up. Karthi's trading his misses too. We're into the final slice of the map, and... 660k lead, it's just insurmountable at this point, and a fail? Unlikely, I just don't see it coming out of the US team. And they will go yeah, up 5-3 no. in this match. Yep, they can hold on here. They will have the two-point lead once again. Spare dropping here at the end. Moi, Andre, Apraxia, and Vaxi with the FCs. Well done for them, but the US take... The point, 5-3. They're two points away from being crowned the champions of the world. Keep in mind, folks, the United States came from the winner's bracket. They only need one game win to take the World Cup. The UK will have to win this and then win the bracket reset. Old man comes in with the pick before the scores are even posted by the referee. They yeah. still freaks up next map. Yeah, from the UK, they're firing back instantly. It just reinforces my point I said earlier that they were thinking about when to pick that coin flip and they had maps lined up. And obviously, Base Drop Freaks is the top of that list. It's potentially the next big coin flip for the UK. Yeah, honestly, hopefully it works for them. It works in their favor because if not, the US will be on match point with their pick. And that's not the position you want to be in, having to win four maps in a row against the US. Right onto the wire. Oh, it's going to get real painful for the UK if they lose this map. Yeah, they really need the point here. As both teams taking some time to think about their fourth man. It has been an exciting World Cup thus far, and this match has not disappointed. Fourth man for the UK. It's got to be James White. This guy is a technical no more player. This has to be him. Yeah. It would also then mirror the match. And there he the is. Up <laughs> there he is. Excellent. They know his boys well. I do. I do what I can. You know, there's the small things in life though that you just got to take. And me knowing my players, that's one of them. I feel like a manager at this point. Always. I'm in my well, you've got, you've I'm got looking the harder Exactly. You're wearing the proper attire for a manager. Petition to add Bay to the UK roster as manager, please. <laughs> I'll take the profile badge, thank you. Yeah, yeah, right. it just says manager. <laughs> second place, like second or first place manager. Should say Any second place. They're still in this. It's not over. It's not over. Doesn't look good now, but UK really do desperately need this point, though. This is a must win for the UK. And we'll see if they can deliver here. Well, Tech is the name of this map. I thought it was base drop. Oh, oh my. Don't do Can you not? I'm sorry. I'm sorry man. I, was, I had a way to go. Oh, never mind. You know what? You know what? So, okay, carry on. Carry on. I've had enough of you, Donan. Get out. No. All right, fair enough. Welcome back. Okay, thanks, man. No worries. So, as you were saying. Well, I think the map will now speak for itself. Sliders, go on. 
Yeah, you're right. Eight. Oh, bear. That's bad. Bro. Caught out on the sliders. Doomsday as well. Icky dropping as well. Not completely over for the UK. Fire Rage and Toy. James Light dropping as well. I think it's three drops a piece. It's Bubble Man versus Baxi. And what a matchup, man. Bubble Man and Baxi, two of the best technical players in the entire game. It's it's gonna be amazing to watch, but their supporting combos are going to matter given how close the score is. Well, Bubble Man and Vaxi. Would it be surprising to see a full combo from either of these players, honestly? So far, everybody navigating quite smoothly here. You guys have to use some accuracy. Didn't say that. Fiery Rage. 95? Fire Rage is dropped. Gonna, that line's gonna take ever so closer to the right hand side of the screen. Icky down! Ooh, that's a big drop from the US. And this is gonna give it to the UK. They're now in control. But again, it's still Bubble Man versus Baxi at this point. Either one of them drops, it's gonna be deadly for their team. Carry potential so high right now. Baxay has to hold on here. But as well as the other three players. Now all the other players, it's so close. Doomsday finding a miss. Oh, Doomsday again, big oh. miss from Doomsday. Fiery drops. It doesn't matter what Bubble Man and Baxay hold on. This is the real contest right now. Yeah. Bear and James Light though. Bear, Max and Toy. James Light so far ahead of Ibki. Yeah, Ibki struggling here. But that was a big miss from Doomsday. But they're still holding the UK. Still holding just over halfway. US are in this while Backstay has combo. Yep, they're still in this very much. If Bubble Man drops, it's over. Oh, Backstay's down! Backstay's down! Bubble Man's gonna start accelerating away here. That Scorby's gonna build so rapidly. Not as dropping as that slider screen, but Scorby 2 is so hard. Yeah, as long as Bubble Man can hold on for just a little longer, he's gonna put this score gap out of reach for the Americans, even if he does break. He has to break basically right now for the US to have any chance whatsoever. And he's not. Bubble Man coming in clutch as he did yesterday versus Germany. For his team, keeping him alive, spare dropping though. It's not gonna be enough. The US needs Bubble Man to break, and they need it soon, hey. Even if they do, James like 30, 1400 combo coming up behind him. Bowman's in 99% accuracy range. What is this? And there's not enough time. Not anymore. Final He's tech cap is out. All eyes on the bubble. Can he lock out this full combo? Bubble man delivering in the clutch. Through the jumps, the sliders. The off-stream Baxi finds another miss. But we're all watching Bubble Man. Put on a clinic here. Oh, the accuracy oh, from this man. My. What is this play? Is he gonna come on through? He's gonna do it! Bubble Man! Bubble Can Man, take a it? bow. Bubble Man, take and a bow. Got it! FC from Bubble Man! Grand Five finals four. and you full combo base drop freaks. What on earth have you oh done? Oh my sir? good lord. I mean, you see Bubble the memes Man. on Reddit, you see the memes on Twitter about how Bubble Man single handedly took down the Germans. Well, can he do it here? Can he oh. topple almost an entire continent? Get like this man the his own theme song. He's a superhero. <laughs> Will Stetson needs to write like a Bubble Man theme song. This is just, it's, it's too good. Like, he's, he's too good. Bubble Man, Will Stetson remix. Matt by Soto. That would be spicy. Well, US, straight into that pick as well. No thank you. Yeah, no so thank you. I was saying no thank you to that play, but I think yeah. that's the match given the capitalization. Yeah, definitely. And since the, you know, Apraxia and Vaxi performed so well on the uh, on Serendipity, taking that point, they're going to go to the other double time pick and try to take one more point. Because the US are two points away. 
UK right behind him in hot pursuit. We're running out of maps. And the question is, will, will Kamino Kotoba be played? No, thank you, Ben. Another old map, 2010. A collab of lots of well-known mappers, including Mr. Doomsday himself. But it's quite long again. We're looking at another three-minute map. Oh my goodness. This is turning into an interesting match here. We've seen it a couple of times already. Single player carries. They do exist in Store V2 and they are so relevant in this grand final stage. Any yeah, definitely. Player, They're relevant now more than ever. Exactly, and any player who manages to get that high combo, if the rest of the, team, if the rest of the seven players cannot do it, they can win the map single-handedly. It's just how it works. Yeah, as we've already seen, we just saw the Bubble Man carry, but here we go to no thank you, the DT pick. Vaxia Praxia in for the Americans with Aki and Hirak. UK sending out Bubble Man Doomsday, Spare, and Moe Yandere, the DT specialist, coming in. Vaxia, Praxia, and Yandere were the three FCs on the last double time pick. Yeah, this map not played against Germany. Again, US going in blind. How will the UK perform? Yeah. In an old map, you would expect Doomsday wanting to get his hands on this. But his act is not good here in the early going. Yeah, they are right, so the pro trade after double time is 9.7. And Doomsday! Doomsday. Was the first yeah, he will find the first miss. Vaxi, right behind him. That's a big miss, but it's early. Yeah, no one you would expect, actually, from the US roster from Vaxi. Yeah, so one apiece he misses right now. We are in 270 BPM, and, well, I think you would find that a couple of players are still single tapping this, which is just insanely. That's ridiculous. BPM. Three of the UK players, Doomsday, Moe, and Spare, all single tapping. Moe Andre! Oh, Big drop at the game. end! Not the not the misses we were expecting. We're not expecting to see Vaxi and Yandere drop. What is happening? You guys with the early lead. They have to... oh, oh, Praxi is yeah. down too! All the previous DTFCs are down. That score's gonna freeze where it is. The rest yeah. of the UK ahead. It's Icky and Hirak versus Bubble Man and Spare. Doomsday, though, has got a nice supporting combo Vaxi right behind him. But I believe it's slightly in favor of the UK. Uh, Doomsday can get his accuracy off. It's going to be so much here, but he's going to make it. Vaxi! Doomsday goes down low! Three misses, two on the British side! Unfortunate for them, but the FCs are still intact. Two thirds of the way. Still, the UK in this. If we see a drop from any of the FCs here, or from the large combos on the American side, the UK could still come back and take this as we allow some time for the client to catch up. Fair Poor client. 99%. Kind of balances out Doomsday's 92. I mean, it's still obviously down, but damn. And has Vax ADC'd? seed? Uh, it may just be client catching up. I'm not too sure. Moe finding another miss, though. Doomsday <laughs> as well. Usually when one player stops and the rest keep going, it could be a sign of a disconnection. We, yeah, we will have to wait and see if it is a... He did! Oh, Vaxi's disconnected! It's That's so DC. big! Can the other three players on the US... Hirak can solo this! Hirak can solo carry! He's still got full combo! Hirak is solo carrying! Oh my goodness! Misses from all the full combos of Mr. except Hirak! Hirak drops! Hirak drops, but has he done enough work? Has he done the work? He has! Are they still going to take this 3v4? A 3v4 win? Are you kidding me? Keeping the eyes on the MP for this, because the score on the screen might not reflect accurately what it actually yeah, is. We will have to check for the MP. We will give you the official word on this. We do not know. And the uh, they do lose. No, no, yeah, okay. No, yep, so it is oh going to the God. UK. Wait a minute. 180,000 points. <laughs> And we're five five, Doland. Disconnection. Five, five. Let's let's just say though that difference was one hundred and eighty k for the UK with a disconnect. So, here I could have done it. 
Oh, no, he couldn't. He couldn't. It would have been really close, though. No. It would have been really close. But, oh, Vaxia is going to be... Apraxia is upset. Can you blame him? A disconnection when you could He's be going up to... 6 to 4. I, I, I do not know how the rules work there, but I believe it counts as zero points if you disconnect. Yeah, it does, because he technically count as failed. Yeah. That's I... just how the game works. No. We're yeah, just getting an official ruling on this. Yeah, we're going to need... Uh, DC does. There it is. DC counts as a fail. I mean, I mean, yeah, it's it's just it's just upsetting. I mean, I understand how it feels. The captain of the team, he's upset because he had that. They had that in the bag. They, you know, thinking they should be up six four. Yeah, that's gonna be a tilt. -up. Five five. Are US, you kidding me? The US have to make sure this doesn't affect them because yeah, you could have yeah. been you could have been on match point here. Yeah, and now you're level. You're, but you are absolutely right though. The US, they need to calm down and put themselves back in this. Because now it's five to five. And they're still two points away from winning the World Cup. They've got to they've got to get it done here. It's a brilliant break for the UK, but the US have got to calm down. Get back in it. The difference is now is that if the UK win their pick, as it's theirs now, the US will not be picking for match point, they'll be picking to stay in the match. Yeah, it's unfortunate though, but that's just how it works. Apraxia really needs to calm down here. Yeah, the US are on tilt, and yeah, I'm hoping I mean, that it's just, it's just like Peppy stepping in. Yeah, Peppy stepping in, yeah. Okay, I mean, that's Peppy. Peppy. Listen, yeah, you have to calm down here, Apraxia. I don't know if there's any rules on like conduct behavior at this point, but like he can't, he can't keep doing this. He's only going to hurt his team. I mean, I think that's the last warning he's probably going to get. Pappy when Pappy comes in and tells you to calm down. Understanding the frustration of Apraxia, though, it, it is upsetting. But the rules are there. Yeah, if this was match point, you'd be rightfully upset. It's not over. They, they still have... You know, they can win They can win it right now. Two maps and it's done. And yeah, nothing, I mean, it's the like US, it's happened. not over. It's not over. You're right. Either team's still very much in this. We could see tiebreaker here. Could see it. And, you know, even if the US lose, you know, they have an entire other set which they can just yeah. win. Yeah. And this map, back say, maybe comes and he doesn't disconnect, they win it. And then, you know, normality is restored. But I guarantee that the US are going to be upset about that, while the UK are breathing a huge sigh of relief. Yeah, unfortunately, a disconnect only aborts the map within the first 30 seconds of play. Uh, so, this was well after that. So, apparently... There might be, there is a rule. That if a player disconnects within 30 seconds... But it was not within 30 seconds, I don't think. Okay, yeah, so if the player was within 30 seconds, they can rematch. This was after yeah. 30 seconds, and therefore it cannot be rematched. Yeah, it's but... Like for a pick. It's, it is unfortunate. It's unfortunate, but that shit, it happens sometimes. It happens sometimes, and you've got it, got to roll it. And they're going to pick Tabby Teferi from the HD pool. Uh, the last pickable map for the UK, and one that we've pretty much said from the start would be one that they've had their eyes on. Choosing this over a potential... Where have I lost it? I completely lost it. By the way, um, thank you guys for over 9,000 viewers right now. Ooh! It's the highest it's, oh, of the entire what, tournament. What, 9,000? It's over 9,000! Okay. <laughs> We did it, now we've got that out of the way. <laughs> so Hidden has been largely avoided so far in this first game here. So we'll see how these players perform. Toy coming in as expected. I hope I hope Vaxay hasn't had a permanent 
power outage or something. Yeah, I hope that... I'll come back. This is really going to swing the course of this match. Yeah, that and that's that's a huge loss for the Americans if uh, Vaxi is unable to return. If Vaxi would want to play this. You know, and we're not going to wait. The match will still carry on regardless of what okay, happens. he's back. He's back. He is back, so that's good news for the Americans. Panic over. That, that would have been just absolutely devastating. Honestly, at this stage, missing any one of your players is devastating considering how good these two teams are. All right. We're in a best of three, ladies and gentlemen. Screw the rest of what we just watched. This is the real yeah, match now. It's come down to a best of three. Tied at five in game one of the grand finals, boys. It's going to be Fiery Rage, Digital Hypno, Toy, and Vaxi for the United States. For the United Kingdom, Bubble Man, Doomsday, OP James, and Carfi. And again, keep your eyes on Vaxi. DC last game. Hopefully, he does not have those problems again. He finds an early miss with Carthy, Bubble Man, and Toy. OP James as well. Everyone finding. I mean, this everyone, map is super everyone's hard. Everyone's dropped. This map is super hard. If anyone full combos this, I mean, we're already left with two can, of them. Three of them, even. Fire Rage. If anybody can find a good chunk of combo here you're gonna put your team in a good position digital hypno with a miss uk pulling it back slowly but the axe are gonna constantly be throwing the <laughs> the, the score advantage out of whack bulb man and fire rage gonna trade it there and again the uk need to win this this is their pick the u.s break this they will have the pick at match point Little fiery drops. Drop the few notes there. UK gonna get right back into it. Take the lead. OP James and Digital Hypno training. Digital Hypno with a bigger miss though. Just a few of those. He's missing again. UK taking it back here. Still, it's a long map though. Only a quarter in. Combos for Toy Vaxay for the US. Combos for Doomsday and Carthy for the UK. Yeah, Doomsday with, with a high combo. Advantage. Combo advantage with the UK. Bubble Man drops though. I mean, it's one of the smaller combos. Yeah, Doomsday and Carthy being matched almost by Toy and Vaxi. But the supporting combos are better on the American side, so the US actually with the combo advantage right now. Slowly overturning it. As we are Whoa. halfway through. Loss of 100s from Vaxi, and he breaks! Oh, Vaxi, that's a big drop! Those 100s would have sewn into his mind, and Doomsday goes as well! Yeah, they're gonna trade it immediately, and the combo advantage back with the Americans. This is actually very close. Bubble Man missing. Carthy and Digital Hypno trading. That was a big drop there. US with the significant combo advantage. Fire Rage though! He's gonna miss, and now the US have a minuscule combo advantage, I believe. It's much lower now. Toy though with a 700 combo. Oh, that red bar. Fiery breaks though. Oh, it's a little bit. This is so close. Four misses. Oh my goodness. Triple miss for both teams. OP James and Toy. Fire Rage and Digital Hypno. They failed. They've got to revive. Or no, Digital has. I think they both did. Bubble Man as well. Carthy's HP is getting low. Still a core of the map to go. Break from Toy here. Oh. It would be so painful. OP James with the big combo for the UK. Oh, yeah. That hidden specialist coming. Out. Oh, Carthy, break it happen at any point. There it is! Triple miss from the UK! Toy holds. Toy holds, but watch for fails. A fail could easily overturn this. Toy is broken! So is OP James, though. They've done it together. But they've got enough. 190k for the US yeah, right, right now. Advantage. US just got to hold through to the end here. Can they hold on? Vaxi and Carthy, Digital Hypno! Digital Hypno! Thanks for so oh, long, the spinner. Don't scare me like that, Habib! <laughs> don't you do that to me! US will sneak it away! 6-5, match point! A uh, tournament point, I think you mean. Yeah, this is the tournament game set match tournament point. If the US take the next point... They are the world champions. The UK need two more in a row to force a bracket reset.
And the this is the US pick match is Suck Duck, me and you. Another technical map, this time with Hard Rock. Lots of flowing patterns, so easy to trip up on. Yeah, definitely. And a pick I would say favors the US. I would Who hope picked? so, because they picked yeah. <laughs> But you're right, absolutely right. The US trying to put this tournament in the books. Trying to reclaim their throne. So far, the UK have won more maps off the US's pick. Albeit one of them was a disconnection. I mean, yeah, I mean, sometimes it happens. Sometimes it's just like that. It, it just, it just, it just happens that way sometimes, unfortunately. Vaxi's still in, hopefully he's, he performed all right in the last match, so hopefully he does not have any more issues with disconnecting. Okay, donating his power for Team UK. So we I like see to that, see. Guys, in the chat, give your teams your energy. If you are cheering for the UK, they need your love and your energy right now. If you're cheering for the US, they are one point away. They need your energy. Hype it up in the chat. Give them your energy. Oh, man. And the, the atmosphere waiting for the last map to it's, start it's, is so tense. Yeah, it's a very tense atmosphere right now. As the tournament is on the line here. Both these teams have played. Yeah, tiebreaker is the only map left after this if the UK managed to win as your arbitrator. And that is such a map. Oh, it's going to exhaust the players going into a reset. Yeah, and if the UK win this, then we have to play a tiebreaker. Oh, man. What a match these guys have been putting on. The only team that's made the US look beatable. And they're exactly, so close to doing yeah. it here. Indeed they are in the UK. A great team themselves. Deserve to be where they're at. Finishing third last year, their highest ever finish. Even losing now will give them the highest finish they've ever had. Well, and but here we go. For the United States, it's Fiery Rage, Ibki, Toy, Vaxi. For the United Kingdom, Bubble Man, Spare, Sororoxis, and OP James. It's on the line. The UK need to win or this tournament is over. The United States looking for their third US World Cup title. Will they get it here or will they be denied? Low start to this one, it will ramp up very quickly into some nasty technical patterns. Yeah, you can't have the meat the moment comes in. And here we go, getting into it now. Is anybody gonna be caught out early here? So far, no one. OP James is the first one to get caught. Sorox is right behind. Early advantage for the United States. It's consistency from the US is proving why they might be named Oswald Champions 2018. Roxas with another drop. Big drop from Sora Roxas. He's failed. He's missed the entire stream. And the US have four full combos. Through the first section. Absolutely insane. Ibki will be Ibki. the first to go. Yep. The UK really needed that, didn't they? They needed it more than ever. But there goes Spare Slider Break on the slow part. Fire oh, and Fire the Rage, though. Gonna trade. Bowman, well, the only full combo for the United over. Kingdom. It's not over yet. Almost halfway through. Spare finds another miss on the slide, but he had really low combos, so that's not gonna hurt the UK too much. Toy and Vaxe, two giants of the US right now. Let's do and it. The UK, the UK need one of them to fall quickly, or this is gonna turn really ugly. Obi James and Spare have missed! Double miss, UK! And the United States are drawing closer to the World Cup title! A third of a map away, but Toy has fallen! Vaxi is the only one left! He's Final taking on Bubble Man! Section coming in. The supporting combos are there for the US, but they're getting there for the UK as well! 
Faxi and Bowman, Icky and OP James dropping together. Faxi just has to hold it. Faxi can hold it. They oh, he dropped! He dropped he it! He dropped Bubbleman, corner of the map left. Is there enough time? The British are coming. The British looking to deny him. Sora Roxas with the miss. Triple miss from the UK. Miss from Toy. Fiery Rage. Bubbleman can do this. still holding. Bubbleman can do this. Fair drops. Bubbleman. Is he going to do it? It's not. Oh, it's so slowly going over. There's not much time left. Are the USA gonna win or will the UK force tiebreaker? This is gonna be K1? so close. Bubbleman score is about to rock it up and towards the end of the map. Oh my god. Is there enough time? Is there oh. enough time? He's trying to pull it back. He's trying his best. It's gonna best. be so close. It's getting their toys dropped. He's done it. He's done it. Done it. Done it. Done it. Oh wait. Yes, he has. Oh my oh, god. god. Oh, He's done it. He has That's done it. Point. He That's has point. done it. 70 points. 70 points. <laughs> I don't believe it! What? Bubble Man is the man! The myth, what? the legend! What? 70 points! What the? Oh, I want to say it so bad! <laughs> it. Oh my goodness, it's coming home, boys! Bubble Man! Arbitrator! Slapped the Americans in the face and said, Not yet! We are not done here. We will not go quietly into I the can't. night. Dolan, I can't. I can't right now. And oh, it's my tie God. breaker time for game one. 70 points. I want to kiss Bubble Man on the mouth. So <laughs> aggressively. Oh my God. Oh my God. If, just think if Vaxi comboed one more note. One less 100. Over. From any player, almost secures that win for the US. If the US had scored just any more, had gotten anything, oh, you they serious? would be the World Cup champions. What a match! <laughs> and now it comes down to tiebreak. How do you, how do you play the tiebreak? The adrenaline on the UK team is going to be through the roof. The US will be disappointed, but they might be in a better position mentally for this now. Oh, it's gonna. Who plays this? Bubble Man Spare, Sora, Carthy looking like the lineup for the UK. Yeah. Fiery, Itkia, Praxer, and Vaxe in the slots for the US. An eight minute map. So let, let's just go ahead and re inform the viewers, those who have tuned in late. I can't talk. <laughs> tuned in late here. If the United States take this tiebreaker point, they are the World Cup champions. If the United Kingdom take this point, we will have a bracket reset and a game two shortly after. So the UK are fighting to force the bracket reset. The US are fighting for the title right now. It's all on the line. Eight it's minutes. all on the line. Eight minutes and 18 seconds of 274 BPM at AR10, approach rate 10. This map just goes nuts from start to finish. 11,000 viewers. Tuning into the tie break. Let's get ready to rumble! Can the UK bring the upset? Can the US bring home the bacon? Let's find out, Doland. Let's bring it on. Eight minutes plus of tie break standing between one of these teams and a potential World Cup victory. Backstay's already broken, so. Early miss, but kind of irrelevant here. Nah, and this given how long this this tie break is. Let's go. Bracket reset. We done it, guys. What are yeah. you doing? <laughs> Early drop, it's over. You can't kill the hype like that, man. <laughs> you can't kill the hype like that. As it's going to build. If you are not shaking right now, then you have no heart and no feelings. How are these players are hitting anything after that? 70 points. These players are the best in the world at what they do. They're zoned in, focused right now. Adrenaline running through their veins. How you play a tiebreaker in these conditions is beyond me, but these eight brave souls will attempt to do just that. A little bit of client lag, but getting through it now. Sora Roxas, Fire section. Ranger, Praxia. Big drop from Sora Roxas, though, that might upset the, uh, the two miss for a while from the United States. 
That's a big act drop down to low 97, so everyone else hitting that 98 mark. Yeah, Store Roxas can get that act up. The UK gonna be taking the lead. Here they do. Still very early on. Inky is down though. The full combos for the US are falling. Early They've advantage all fallen. for the UK. Three FCs for the UK. Carthy is down though. Big miss from him. Fiery drops as well though. It's two FCs for the UK still. Bubble Man and Spare taking on Vaxe. Vaxe not that far behind the full combos because he had that early miss. And it's two to one in the FC department basically. However, the UK are going to need to hold for an insanely long amount of time to beg. The spare is down, and it's Bubble Man and Vaxi again. Apraxia falls as well. It's the duel once again. Vaxi has lost it, though, once oh, again. Bubble Man. Standing well, yet again. This man won this, this map straight after it was revealed on Showcase. He is comfortable on this. And if any man is going to do it, it would be him. Yeah. I don't want to curse him, though. So that's it, Bubble Man. You're on your own. Okay, you got through that without cursing him. Good job. But right now, it's still anyone's game. Honestly, it, with a map this long, like unless Bubble Man FCs the full way, it's not going to be a solo carry here, realistically. Unless he FCs for which he can do. He is fully capable of doing just that. But yeah, the rest of the team up a combo, needs, though. Yeah, the teammates right. have to bring it home as well. If yeah. they get two combos on the US, it can offset him. If it's going to come home, to 500 Ks. Yeah, if it's going to come home, it's going to be it's going to need a full team effort. Apraxia dropping yet again. The Americans are behind, not completely out of it, but Bubble Man is trying to put them out of it. As we are almost halfway through, approaching that mark. About three minutes in, five minutes to go. Fire Rage, Ifki, big combos for the US. Sora rocks us. So we have elemental up there as well. Bubble Man. Just, oh, Carthy! A drop from the UK, finally! We see one. But their combos, their teammates' combos are so good! Right there, to back them up! Oh, Inky, backseat, Sora Roxas, a Praxi is dropping! Fire Rage, the biggest combo now! Bubble Man, serious points! A Fire Rage goes down! That's absolutely monumental! If that is a huge miss! Bubble Man and Spare are going to bank some massive score advantage off of the Americans here. We may be seeing a game two. Carthy dropping. But it's not the drop that America needs. They need Bubble Man to drop or Spare. Ideally both, right? If they don't Ideally both break. Both. Fiery Rage can't seem to keep up. Icky, Vaxi, Apraxia going back to rebuilding their combos. Try to be there for if the UK drop. Carthy does drop. Carthy is offsetting Fiery Rage, though. So the US not really losing that many more points due to this. But Bubble Man and Spare are just murdering them right now. Perhaps they're kind of the lowest score in the lobby. Sorox Sor is biggest Spare down. down. Icky falls as well. But Bubble Man is there. He has double the points of almost everyone in the lobby. Again, if Bubble does not drop, it's over for the United States. Here, Sorox is in Spare Big there. Drops. Hold on! Carthy! Oh, yeah. Sora! Triple miss from the Brits! It doesn't matter. It just doesn't matter. It's not Bubble Man. Back say the big combo on the US right now, pushing 750. Yeah. Bubble but Man it's... needs a drop for the US to actually have a chance, and he's almost put it out of range by himself. Double misses on both sides. Get through the next intense jump section. Bubble Man! Every combo break for the US is painful as long as Bubble holds on. Bubble Man has ascended. He's no longer Bubble Man. He is Elemental Hero Bubble Man. Oh, there he goes. Oh, no, but he's dropped. He's dropped finally. But the UK still have such a massive lead that it doesn't matter. Vaxi's down as well. That's the big combo Fire for the US. Rage Vaxi down. needed to hold. This section is so intense. Though. And now it's Carthy. The biggest combo with 400. The US have a chance now, but they have to hold through the end and need to see some more misses. Bubble Man, though, has put in so much work for his team. That is ridiculous. Oh, my goodness. But I don't know if there's enough time. You, the U.S. still building right now. Carthy is dropped. Vaxi as well. Combos Spare, are so even. Spare Sora and Bubble Man, though, keeping up the pace. 280,000 the lead for the U.K. right now. We're into the final three minutes or so. Yeah, final three minutes. Insane. 
match so long, so intense. Not looking good for the US. They're not completely out of this, but they need to see a meltdown from the UK soon. And they've got to have their combos up. Bowman, it's fair. This might be it. Apraxia falls as well, though. Gonna slow that down. Fire Rage and Iki trying to keep up for the US. Sora Roxas is there to stop the advance with his 400 combo, but the US have the advantage. He's dropped, though. Apraxia, Carthy, Sora again. The Iki, Americans... Fire Rage here, but the US have to hold now. But they gotta hold all the way through. They have the combo. That is advantage. massive to come back on a map of this length. It is a lot of points on an eight-minute map. Yep. It might still be possible if they can hold. Apraxia has got to get it together, though. Sorox's big misses. Failing spare. Fire Rage and Apraxia drop, though. Vaxi and Iggy there with combos. Bubble Man trying to get up there to negate it with 350. Can he do it? He doesn't quite negate two US players, but it's very close. The US. Second biggest score in the lobby is owned by Vaxi. Bit by bit, the United States are pulling it back. They're running out of time, though. And actually, the map's over. This ending is very slow. Yeah, this Which is a slow ending. Can, we'll take this to a bracket reset. This Seven, is six. amazing. Bubble Man putting in the work once again here today. And the United Kingdom appears as if they are going to earn the bracket reset that they wanted. I've only got one question for you, Dota. What's that? Are you ready? I was born ready. We're going again. We're going to have one more match. Grand Finals will go to game two, barring no crazy disconnects or fails. And Bubble Man, what a performance. The US tried. But it's going to be the United Kingdom taking game one, 7-6. Game two, coming up next. 2,467 combo. Bubble Man. Wow. <laughs> All right. So for those of you that do not are not aware of how this works, so this was a this is a double elimination tournament. Before this match, the United States had not lost a game, meaning they are not eliminated. So both teams have lost one match in total. They will play one more game, and it's for the World Cup title. So that's how it's going to work. So the UK have not won just yet, but they're one step closer, Bay. It's halfway home. We're in the middle of the ocean right now. It is, it is halfway home. That is, a, that is a good way to put it. Going into the bracket reset then, Dolan, players have played every map apart from two. Uh, three, sorry, they did not play. 